Hello, this is Andy Reistetter. I'm on a journey to Olympic golf here in Panama City with Paula Carey. And I'm here, as you know, driving to Rio on this journey to Olympic golf. Other people, it's the holiday time. We have the Multi Plaza Mall right next door here. We're here at the Courtyard Panama Multiplex Mall. And most people are here Christmas shopping. But Paula, you're here for a different reason. Can you tell me a little bit about that? This treatment with poor blood stem cells is going to help me um, with arthritis and uh, autoimmune problems. Well, I met this beautiful lady at breakfast today. Can we sit down and have a little bit more conversation and learn a little bit more about this? Absolutely. Tell me, how did you first find out about your disease? Well, when your hands start hurting and your back and uh, sometimes it's hard to get out of bed and sometimes you can't sleep. Uh, I had surgery on my neck and my lower back, so the arthritis has really gotten ahead of the game with me. Um, I also had uh, throat cancer and I had uh, several radiation treatments which caused issues with my thyroid. Thyroid uh, definitely affects your skeletal system. Uh, even though I do weightlifting every day and that uh, weight-bearing exercises supposed to help keep your bones strong. And so far they are, however, it's not without issues. So I'm here to um, have the stem cell um, IVs, <laughs> and um, I think that uh, it takes a little time to see what kind of success I'll have with it, but uh, I feel very confident that it will be successful. It's a very high technology and complex field, but just simply, what is, what is stem cell and how does it impact and relieve the pain and help the disease? Well, the point of uh, the treatment is that they take the stem cells from umbilical cord and they mix it, I'm not sure how, what they do, but then they infuse it in you. Um, after all, the stem cells have zero years on it, so they are brand new cells that are active and ready to heal. Uh, your own stem cells are as old as you are, so obviously they're kind of worn out. They've been through a lot of trauma as it is. So um, these new stem cells are a great way for people to be able to heal. Uh, the stem cells are infused in you in an IV, um, and they go all over your body and address the areas of your body that are uh, sick and hopefully it will be open. Why Panama City? What, what brought you here for this treatment? I had uh, some good friends that came ahead of me. They bought their doctor from uh, Atlanta, which is where I'm from. And the doctor looked through the clinic um, and he felt that it was the place to be. Um, the doctor uh, that has the clinic was uh, born in Panama, but he grew up in the United States and came back to Panama because the U.S., the FDA, does not allow us to do poor blood uh, stem cells. So, it seemed like the right thing to do. I'm here to take him up on uh, getting it fixed. Well, you look great, and I know you've been battling this for a number of years. And your, your last name is familiar to a lot of folks, right? Especially baseball folks. Yes, it is. Um, I am of the Harry Carey family. 
My late husband was Skip Perry, who broadcast for the Atlanta Braves for 33 years, and uh, I was along for that entire ride uh, with uh, uh, many uh, Harry Carey interventions. So we had quite, uh, quite a family affair. Are you a big baseball fan? I love it. <laughs> Atlanta's a great town, too. and It is. Atlanta's wonderful. Um, it has its issues. Um, I would love to see our team grow and be successful and hopefully, hopefully win another World Series. That would be, that would be the, great, the great one. <laughs> well, Paula, I want to thank you for a delightful breakfast. And you know, I, I meet, I've met several inspiring people along the trail here on the journey to Olympic golf and, and you are very inspiring and, you know, the pioneering work you're doing and uh, all these treatments and stuff are not only helping you but the folks that come behind you with this disease, so. Well, that's what it's all about. If somebody doesn't go ahead and learn what's going on and be the guinea pig, those coming behind don't get a chance, so. Well, you're a very graceful and beautiful guinea pig. Is there anything else you would like to share with, with people about the stem cell research and treatment here in Panama City? Um, so, I mean, it's not been uh, unbearable. It certainly has actually been a lot easier than I thought it would be. Um, but now I have to find things to do. <laughs> There's better vacations, but it's doable. Yes, absolutely. Well, again, thank you so much for the interview. It's a pleasure meeting you, and thank, thank you for the inspiration. Thank you.